super excited about. I love roller buckles, but sometimes I think it was like the 4th of July fireworks. Except it's Friday the 13th. <laughs> Anyway, hey guys, you know what time it is for me. Of course, it is time for my Diet Coke break. And it is also time for the Sephora VIB sale. Um, for those of us who are not VIB Rouge and didn't spend quite as much money yet, um, the sale starts for us today um, with an extra 20% off of anything on the website. And I think it's today, I'll put the dates below for sure, and I think that the code is VIB20. Actually, I know the code is VIB20, um, so I'll link that below as well. But I just thought that today I would go ahead and show you guys what I ordered this morning. I know I don't have these products to actually physically show you in hand and I can't really do a review on them either so I can't tell you if I'm going to like them, if they work, if they don't work or whatever because I think that everything I ended up ordering are things that I've never tried before. While 20% off is not a huge huge deal unless you're going to order really big money stuff. Um, it's still exciting. I didn't order anything that was really big and expensive because I just don't typically ever order anything that's big and expensive even if it's on sale for 20% off. Now if I can catch something for you know 75% off then you know I'm the girl to go that route. <laughs> but anyway okay, so I'm gonna read off of my iPad. Um, first I'll tell you what I ordered. I'll insert a couple pictures and then I will tell you what it's supposed to do. So these are just things that um, looked intriguing to me. Okay so the first thing that I ordered is the is from the Sephora collection and it is called the Brush It Off Cleansing Brush Wipes. looked really interesting to me and what the Sephora site says it says that they're useful wipes effectively used to remove dirt and residue from makeup brushes it says they come in a handy travel size package it includes six individually wrapped packets non-alcohol based formula keeps brushes clear and hygienic and extends the use and life of your brushes so they look super interesting um, there is a box of I believe it's a box of six wipes and it is on sale for three dollars normally five but on sale for three and I watched a little video demo and you basically just wipe your brush across it looks like a makeup wipe across the front you turn it over you can use it for the back so you can use it as much use as you can get out of the square you can use it as many times as you want. And the reviews underneath it were really great, so we're gonna give them a try because anything simple, I'm all for, especially when it comes to cleaning makeup brushes. So those we're gonna try, so that's the first thing that I ordered. Now, the second thing that I decided to try out um, is something from a brand I'd never heard of, but it's the brand Human Kind. And the, it actually looks like human, the plus sign kind so I don't know if it's human plus kind or if you just call it humankind because I'm obviously illiterate today and I you know don't know how to pronounce it so but this is the human kind if that's the way you say it um, these are the deep cleansing cloths and they are ten dollars Now these says that it is a set of super soft cleansing cloths designed to gently exfoliate skin and aid in the removal of makeup and impurities. And it says that they are long lasting, reusable, and you can use them in conjunction with like a facial, your own facial cleanser, like to remove your makeup if you want, or you can just use them without. Kind of like the makeup eraser, which I have been super intrigued about ever since it came out, gosh, last year sometime when I first heard about it, and I just had not ordered it yet um, but I wanted to try these out because basically and you can see from those pictures I put in it looks like two kind of washcloth size cloths and it looks to me like the same general idea as the makeup eraser you're supposed to just wet the cloths underwater and essentially you'll wipe your makeup off now this does say you can use it in conjunction like if I wanted to take my makeup remover cleanser that I use um, at night you could use that and then use these cloths to wipe it off but I'm hoping that it's gonna be like the makeup eraser and it's a box of two and they're ten dollars so if they work anything like they the reviews said that they do because the reviews are really good on this also I've never heard of these so you might want to check those out if you're in the market for a makeup eraser type product now speaking about the 
original makeup eraser I did go ahead and get one of those just because I know that that works well I take that back I don't know that it's gonna personally work for me but I haven't seen anybody say anything bad about the makeup eraser at all people that I trust their opinions on YouTube nobody has said anything bad or that it doesn't work so I went ahead and ordered the makeup eraser just because I got that little extra 20% off and I wanted to see how it worked and then that'll be a good way for me to compare those other two the cheaper ones that I just ordered to the makeup eraser now if the two that were ten dollars work just as well then I may return the makeup eraser I don't know how that works returning something like that to Sephora because that's like something you actually wet and use but anyway I'll figure it out but um, here's a picture of the makeup eraser if you don't know and the makeup eraser is 20 bucks Now the next thing I ordered is also from the Sephora collection. This is called the, do you hear the rooster and the birds and the acorns falling? It's just a general farm area around here, except I'm in the middle of the city, so it's kind of weird. I'm still not sure about the rooster. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, the next thing I ordered is also from the Sephora collection. This is a set of um, 30 charcoal swabs and it's called the Detox It Out Charcoal Swabs. Now there are 30 of them, so here's a picture of what those look like. to the website it says that these charcoal swabs are an essential addition to any makeup toolkit that can be used for a multitude of tasks including quick fixes to eyeliner applying liquid or dry product and removing makeup from hard to reach places that cotton pads can't and it says the black color of the swabs show light colors highlighters and luminizers better than the traditional white swabs it says the dual ended design makes them versatile so a little better than q-tips if you use those sometimes when I get mascara on my lids or something like that I'll take a q-tip and I'll wipe it off they're kind of rough on my eyelids but I mean they do the job but I figured for three dollars these just looked really interesting and this is a made of charcoal and I'm all about the charcoal detox thing I just I don't know I love that whole premise so these are really intriguing to me and they're double-ended so you can use them you know as many times as you need to to touch up or to apply things but anyway they just look interesting they're three dollars so I added them that tree is going to be completely out of acorns by the time this video is over. The next thing I ordered is something that I saw Mary from A Love Tart talking about earlier this week. She had ordered the, um, this is also from the Sephora collection, the Ombre Obsession Face Palette. And it's um, like a face palette of blushes and I will insert a photo here. So she actually showed this on her website because she's VIB Rouge so she had already gotten this and she was able to show what it looks like so I'll link that below if you guys want to look at that but first of all the thing is huge you can see it in her video and it looks really really beautiful the colors look amazing is this a lot of the blushes are like this ombre effect so they go from light to dark so you can swirl your brush you can use them all you can use the lighter you can use the darker it's not like I need more blushes but the thing I really like about this is it, it there's such a huge shade range in this compact that I can go for there's there's pinks there's neutrals um, there are more peachy shades there's more coral shades and in the middle it looks like a highlighter so it is seriously like an all-in-one and if it works half as well as I think it's going to. Um, I'm gonna be really excited about it. But anyway, it's $34. It says it's $175 value, but I'm really excited about it. It looks really, really gorgeous um, on her channel. It looked beautiful. So if you're interested in something like that, you might wanna check that out. The next thing I ordered was some um, something from the perfume world. So this is from, is it Atelier? Atelier, I don't know how you say this, but anyway. Cologne. I don't necessarily need perfume or cologne, but I'm kind of on the hunt for something different and something new that I don't already have. And so I'd heard a lot of good things about these. Um, the reviews were really good on these as well. So this set is $25 and you get four um, vials of their perfumes to try out. And the good thing is they are their sprays, which I'm...
But I also really like to have um, sprays that are like purse size. And I think that this is going to be a great way to try and see if I like any of these. But they all sounded really, really nice. Um, it comes with one, I'm not even going to try to say the names of them because they're all, I don't know if this is French or what, but the names of the perfumes I can't really pronounce, so I'm not going to butcher it. But I'll tell you what the four are like what the scents are supposed to be. So there's one that it says is a citrus fresh fragrance with notes of mandarin, ginger, and vetiver. And it says that it's supposed to just smell really, really good, like a cool breeze through a sun-drenched citrus orchard. So obviously that sounds great. Then the next one says a floral and fresh fragrance with notes of magnolia from Louisiana, bitter orange from Seville, and atlas cedarwood from Morocco. So anything that has like cedarwood or like that sort of more masculine, I really like. So that sounds like it's going to smell great. The next one says it's a woody and floral fragrance. And I, like I said, I love those woody kind of fragrances. It says notes of fig leaf from Provence, bergamot, and cedarwood from Virginia. So that sounds like it's gonna smell great. And then the last one says that it is a woody and citrus fragrance with notes of Atlas cedarwood, lemon, and white amber. And it says just a clean citrus scent and then it's got the woody like base notes. They sound like they're gonna smell incredible. So like I said, the set of um, four of the sprays that you can try out um, is $25. So I figured that would be probably a good thing to try since I am in the market for just kind of a new fragrance for like winter, I think. Okay, I have two more things. Um, the next thing is also from the Sephora collection. This is just the Purely Pure Organic Cotton Facial Pads. Okay, and this is um, a set of 60 organic cotton pads and they're $6. I've never tried these from Sephora, but I'm almost out of cotton pads all together. So I figured I would give these a try. I know it's only 60 and I know $6 sounds like a lot just for 60, but I want to try them because it says they're 100% organic facial cotton. They're soft, extremely smooth. Um, and it says that they're softer and easier on your skin, making these pads ideal for those with sensitive skin. So I'm trying to do things that are a little more gentle and a little bit better for my face. So I'm really excited to actually try these out. So I went ahead and ordered those to have on hand. And then the last thing that I ordered um, is just the regular cotton rounds that they have from Sephora. So this is just the soft touch cotton pads. So you get 70 cotton pads in here and these are $4 and these are just their regular cotton pads so I figured I would give those a try as well and at 20% it's not too bad. So those are the things that I ordered today from the VIB sale at Sephora online. I do get free shipping because I did that deal at the beginning of the year where I paid the $10 for the year free shipping so that's really great. And you guys know how I love samples. So I cheated a little bit and broke my order up into three separate orders. I still use the 20% off on every single one. Um, and so it didn't cost me any more than it would have. Shipping was free on all of it, but that allowed me to get nine free samples of different things they're offering right now. So you might wanna do that. You might not, it might be just something silly that I do. Um, but anyway, I went that route so I could get more free samples. And um, I got 20% off on everything because you can use this 20% as many times as you want between now and I can't remember the date, but I will list it below. And I also went through Ebate, so don't forget to do that. Um, I got 4% back doing that, which is not a lot, but it really adds up in the end. I got um, a check yesterday from Ebates that was $35 just from little things that I had ordered over the past, I don't know how often they do it, three or four months. So, I mean, $35 is $35. It's a tank of gas and a Diet Coke, you know, whatever, however you want to view that. But anyway, I will put the link to Ebates below too if you want to go through that. That's a really great way to earn a little bit of cash back on your purchases online. You know, every little bit helps in this economy. I hope that this has been a little bit helpful for you guys. If maybe you were wondering what to get or looking for something that's not just your typical makeup and just what you see a lot of people ordering. I try to go out of the box a little bit and order some stuff that I've never tried before, which is all of this stuff. So I'm kind of excited to get it all and try it out. And when I get it in, I'll show it to you guys. And then after I use everything, I'll also do reviews on it if you would like me to. But anyway, I would love to know what you guys are getting from the Sephora VIB sale. So tell me below the things that you're going to get. I hope you guys really do have a terrific Friday afternoon, evening, whenever it is that you're watching this. Thank you for watching this video. I really, really appreciate it. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.